Hello! Welcome to Maxi's Fun Time. This is Maxi, and we are back in Aquarian Skies, our Skybox Let's Play. Um, I just did an episode, and it cut off and corrupted the file, so I'm going to have to do all this all over again, so I'll show you everything. First, I'll show you what we just did. We just made this, right here. Induction smelter. And the reason we made this is because our power supply is going to be... this. In order to get this, we need to put the promethium dust into a magmatic cru crucible. And the magmatic dust is made like this. And this is real easy to make. We have all this. We can get this without going to the nether, but there's nether ore in the nether we can grab too. But we can get the sulfur without that. We can get the sulfur from several different places. We can even get sulfur from smelting this thing out. It's a 25% chance. Um, we can put the silvery dust in here and it'll in a crucible furnace and, and make sulfur and get it from bees. Which I think we're probably going to have to end up doing bees anyway. So. Throw that out there. Um, but there are sulfur ore in the nether and it gives you quite a bit of, of sulfur. So we shouldn't have to worry about sulfur. Um, and then we put that into the magmatic engine. Now the problem with that is the magmatic engine or the magmatic crucible requires the nether brick. Now we can make the nether brick like this, which is what we're going to do. And we can get nether rack right here using this boiler. It gives you everything in here it gives you. It even gives you some of the marsupial, which is cool. And it gives you clay. You don't have to worry about doing the whole water clay thing anymore. And uh, salt. This is wonderful. You can put the salt into the uh, pulverizer and it'll turn it into two salt. So that's cool. And eventually we'll get this piped up to here underground. What I want to do is to come over to this little thing over here and build a little platform. That is actually lower than this platform. It should be too lower, if I'm not mistaken. And that'll allow us to build like a big huge platform underneath here and light it up. So that'll be cool. And we are full up again on this thing. Uh, I showed this last time. Well, it's not exactly filled up, but it's close enough. Let's uh, go ahead and put this. Now, this thing will wreck you. Okay, so you don't want to turn this on like right here because it'll hit you. You want to go back as far as possible and still click on it and then back up. And then don't come back over here until it's done. So, and one bucket will give it a one cycle throw, I believe. That's how it works. Oh, we need something before we go over there and show you this. Um, that's not going to help us now. Um, this method right here of cutting down trees gives you a crap ton more stuff than you'd ever imagine. Like, we, look, look at this. This is full of oak leaves, um, or saplings. I've got vines and saplings in here. Um, we got barrels full of the leaves and things. I mean, I need to put this back on shearing just to get some more leaves. And we need to upgrade this chest too, to like a diamond chest. And I'll do that off camera. And then I'm doing more gravel into the uh, <coughs> the um, sifter, sif, siver up there so it can try to get some more diamonds and stuff out of it. Um, we do need to eat. Um, I've showed you all how to make fries. Now fries gives you one and a half meat pops back. So, I've been using them. 
Our next stage up, I believe, is tomato soup. If I'm not mistaken. Which requires um, carrots. And I think I can use potatoes too. I think you can use potatoes. So if you can use potatoes in make stock, we we'll use potatoes and and tomato tomatoes. Um, I just used all this stuff in that last recipe. So um take that upstairs in a minute. Oh we need to use this. Actually we need to make some logs. And I'll turn these into sticks. There we go. And I need two fences. I'll make some torches out of that extra sticks later. I think I got extra sticks somewhere else too. So we should be able to put that there and that there. Okay, now let's go get our grass seed so we can go ahead and start hooking this up. And then I'll show you around the different stuff I've already done. Um, I think I'll put it up here. Yes, yes. Okay, so um, I took the other one. We don't need both of these working on this. Let me jump up here. This one will put it in, and and don't sit. I had two on there just so it would go faster. It goes a little bit slower, but this one here, I put leaves in here, and then it fills this thing up, and then it keeps right clicking on it. And and as you can see, it works really good. And I'm going ahead and getting the dirt out of here and putting it in my other bag, and I'm going to fill the farm thing up off camera and hook it up and what I want to do let me show you this what I want to do is to put a water block in the middle and then I want to put a hive on top of that and that's why we're going to do our bees in, in each each farm plot is going to have a hive in it and hopefully that'll work out for us So, this is lit up pretty good, as far as I know. It reaches all the way in. I, I, that's why it's designed like this. And uh, we're going to pop this in, hopefully, the middle, which should be about right here. And it should spread. So, we'll see. Hopefully, next time we have some animals out here. This is our new home. Um... I hooked the door up. I hooked one door up. I don't think we're only going to use one. I want the double door look though. Um, and these are the amber blocks. You take the amber over there and you make it into a block and then you put that in a 2 by 2 area and then it turns it into the brick. And that's how you make those. Um, I did the wood on top because I thought it looked nice with the wood on top of it. And then monsters started spawning up there so I had to jump up there and put torches all around it. Which was funny. These doors glitching. Um, we're probably going to have two more of these over here, and then over there beside the mop spawner is going to be a big platform of just dirt surrounded by fencing for us to grow like the um, fruit trees. And that is annoying. It's something, some, it drops and it doesn't catch it on here, so it, it flies into my inventory, which is really annoying. Um, I have hooked this up over here to where it's automated. I don't have to come over here anymore, except to switch these out. I need to put a luck um, dagger in here instead of this one. I need to find my luck one. I mean, this one's got luck one on it, but I had another one that was luck on it. I think I had one of the bronze ones that was luck. What I need to do is to make a millennium one and put it in here. Because it'll last a whole lot longer. 
I don't think these gain experience while they're in here, so I'll have to level it up. But, as you can see, it works pretty good. And it, and it does behead for you, so you can just get the heads this way. And I'm going to put this in here because I don't need that on me. And I've made some barrels here for all the basics of the head. Um, the, 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 uh, God, my, what they're called? The black skeletons. <laughs> I forgot the name of them. <laughs> I'm awful. Anyway, I want their skulls in there for, I want them separate, so I'm putting them in there. And I'll probably put another barrel out here f for the Enderman skulls. I don't think we have too much trouble out of that. Uh, I, don't, I don't think that machine can kill the, the Enderman. So this this is for that. Um, we are going to be building the MP, ME system pretty soon because I think we have everything we need for it. At least a small one. See how the grass is growing. Yeah, yep, that'll work. Um, at least the small the small uh, little item things we can upgrade it once we get more materials. Now I know we can do... Oh, I've been putting lava in here and making obsidian and we've got um, 15 obsidian but I need... Four... Oh. I need some dust. I don't remember how much dust it requires. I want 10 here. So... And four for the enchanter I'm going to do right here in a minute. So, how much does one of these give in dust? Four. In... What? What's an obsidian rod for? Infused obsidian rod. Okay. Ooh. And it uses. Mmm. What is that? Infused flux electron. How do you make that? Oh, I hate that button. I'll not use this. I need to make it. No. no. Flux blend, which is electron bled in a fluid transposer with destabilized redstone. I believe that's just melted down redstone. We might have to hook that up. That might be something we need to look into. The diamond upgrade, which requires no diamonds. That's awesome. I mean, we got the one up above this one, though, so we don't need this diamond. One. We got the 10 level. One. <sighs> okay, but that's not what we're looking for. Anyway, back. Okay, so we need eight. We need two obsidian. Um, let's just do a couple. I mean, I can get more obsidian. I'm not going to the nether in this episode anyway. Well, that's doing that. I'll grab the lead. Um, I was wanting to upgrade my tanks, and I believe we need 
That should be enough, I think. Let's grab. It won't hurt us to have extra. Here we go. I mean, this thing here makes massive amounts of lava. So, let's get 16. That should give us 4. So put that there, and this there. There we go. Where's it going? Oh, is it going in this? It is. <laughs> I had that set up just right and I didn't even know it. Okay, so... That's four. Let's go to tank. Here we go. So hardened, and the next one's reinforced. And yeah. So let's grab this puppy here. This is the one we really needed to upgrade anyway. So, um. We'll put this in here. And we'll put this on the sides. Bam, baby. 32. Twice as much buckets now. And now we can pop this back on here. And we can let that go for a longer period of time without switching it out. Now, we're going to need to fill this up to here. Which means I'm going to need another bucket. <laughs> I need to make a bunch of those. That's my aim bar, is it? Okay. Three. There we go. And so pop that there. There. There we go. No, no, no. Idiot. Okay. fill these up while we're waiting. Okay, so we can go ahead. God damn it. I need to hook that. Um, next time around, that up there is getting hooked into the side of this. Um, let's go up here. I want my water thing. Let's get on my nerves. I need to empty it out anyway so we can upgrade it. There we go. At least I think it needs to be empty. I don't want to waste the water that's in there or, or any other liquid. There we go. And we should be able to pop our bucket back in here. And I can move this over here if I need to. There we go. This I did it last time. Let's 
stood here like this and do this. And uh that's pretty good. Um we're gonna need a lot of obsidian dust though. Because our next upgrade to powers is gonna require hardened uh glass. That should be enough. When this, this should, yeah, okay, and then we'll switch it back to that, and then we'll put a thing of water in there. There you go. That'll work for now. And uh, now we can take half of this and then put it over here. Now let's hook this up. We need a book and two diamonds. So we should have diamonds in here now. Uh, there's one. And I have two. There we go. And the book is string. Do I have any extra string in here? No. How's our armor? Yeah, we're going to need new armor pretty soon. I might hook up with some metal armor. There we go. I know we shouldn't be jumping, but we got plenty of food now. So. Mm, nope, that's French fries. Actually, I need some more French fries. French fries. <laughs> um, let's be using this one. Uh, where'd my string go? That's oh, in the hunter's pack. I should have checked there first. I guess like this. Book. Oh, three paper. Oh, dude. And we do we don't we don't have paper, do we? I don't think I have paper. Um, how can we make paper? Paper. Okay, we can use wood chips. And how do we get wood chips? From a pole visor. Cool. So. Sweet. <laughs> I want to get this done today. Oh, cool. That makes a lot of paper. So I'm going to put that there. Oh, and I need those things which I can do like this. I'm going to make a, a few of them because I'm going to need more books anyway. There we go. Sweet. Now we can put the book on top. The diamond on either side. There we go. And can we make the upgraded version? Yes, we can. Gold chunk loader. We don't want the chunk loader. No, we don't want the magic mirror. Potion generator. No, we don't want to smelt it down. What does this smelt down into? 
Molten obsidian. Okay. Um, I know there's another enchanting table. The auto enchanter? Which doesn't require. Ooh, I should We can. We'll look at that later. This just gives us uh, the chanting option. We can get some of the, rid of these some of these levels. Get that out of there. Put that there. And um, shoot, where? Let's put it. This our new house. This will be our first feature. Hey, we got something. Cats. Oh, it's the jungle over here. So we got cats. And we're gonna make a fisher on our next episode. So we'll have some fish. Maybe we can get a cat. I'm hoping for something else besides cats though. Mm. Enchanter. We'll figure out some other place for it. And um Let's do our bow. If we can get eight levels. Looks good. <coughs> Excuse me. Ooh, power one. That'll work. That gives us an enchanting. I'm I'm gonna have to look it up. I know there's another enchanter. I'll have to figure it out. Oh well. Well, I think that's about it for now. Um, I'm going to keep producing this hardened glass. So we can make upgrades and we'll keep filling this thing up. Hopefully we can get uh what's what we need for the next upgraded tank before we end the show. The last upgraded tank is resident which is endurium ingots. Which is uh, shiny metal, shiny tin, and ender. Hmm, I need 1,000 of those, so I'd need four ender eyes or ender pearls for that one. So reinforces is about the best we can do right now. What about the ME force class? I don't know. I think that'll do it for now. This is Meg and uh, make sure you hit that like button if you like the episode. Smack that like button. Um, if you want to know when I do more videos, hit the subscribe button and they'll send you little notifications when the videos come out next. You can come and check them out. If you want to share these videos with your friends, you can uh, hit the link below.
the share link below and uh, you can post that on your uh, Facebook Twitter whatever you use and I will see you on the next episode